It is said that if you pick the lehua flower, the sky will start to rain until you put it back. Lay makers always pick the lehua flower on their way out of the forest, never on the way in. If they do, the forest will start to fog from the rain and lay makers will get lost. Why does this happen? Well, it starts with a legend about that very flower, the legend of Ohia Lehua. This legend starts on the island of Hawaii, in the district of Puna where the beautiful girl named Lehua lived. Lehua was known throughout the island for her stunning beauty. She was kind-hearted and had a loving personality. Lehua was loved by the Apapane bird, which was said to be her amakua, or her personal guardian. Lehua was loved by the young warrior named Ohia. He was known throughout the island to be as strong as he was kind and was loved by all who knew him. Lehua and Ohia fell in love with one another the moment they first saw each other. So deep in love, they were soon married and were very happy, but it did not last long. One day while Ohia was training, the goddess of fire and lava, Pele, noticed the handsome warrior. Pele approached Ohia and asked if he would leave Lehua to be with her. Ohia refused Pele, for he was in love with Lehua. Infuriated by Ohia's rejection, Pele created a ring of fire on the ground, trapping the two of them in the ring. As the fire grew closer around them and was about to burn them, Ohia lifted Lehua up. The fire transformed Ohia into a twisted and ugly tree. Lehua begged for Pele to transform Ohia back. Pele laughed at pitiful Lehua and walked away, satisfied with what she had done. What Pele didn't realize was that the other gods were also watching what she had done to Ohia and were disappointed. <laughs> Having pity on the young lovers, the other gods turned Lehua into a beautiful red flower and placed her in the branches of the tree that was once her lover. The Apapane bird still visits Lehua to this day as she sits in the arms of her Ohia, 